What did you say? Oh. <laughs> I'm cleaning your remote. What do you mean? What does it look like I'm doing? <laughs> it needs a little dusting. <laughs> Which one are you going to use today? You want my all black or do you want the white and black? You pick first. Okay. Well, the black. I always love. Sounds on a remote. Doesn't it sound nice? Or even just gliding my nail. Like that. Even just gliding my nail like that. I'm happy you came over. So many fun sounds. I'm happy you came over. So happy. So happy. You look comfy. Very comfy right there. I can see it in your eyes. I can see that you appear to be a little happy right now. Right there. Right there. This is the white one. Do you think you want the white one? Feels really nice on my nails too. It feels really nice on my nails to glide. I think I like the white one better. Okay, I'm gonna play with the white and you can play with the black. Did you bring any games? But you have the best games. How did you forget? I pulled out a couple games. Do you want to see what I have? Creed could be a lot of fun. The Caribbean, 1715. Legendary pirates rule the land and sea, plundering fortunes and bringing empires to their knees. Among these outlaws is Edward Kenway, a fearless young captain who earns the respect of the pirates, but whose thirst for gold and glory 
may destroy everything they have built. I wonder if Edward is going to destroy everything that they have built. <laughs> have you played this one? Well, let me know how you rate it. So I have that. I have The Last of Us, of course. I can't believe they made a series out of this. It was such a good game. So fun. I really, really enjoyed playing this game. So let's see what they put on the back. Joel and Ellie, brought together by harsh circumstance, must survive a brutal journey across the U.S. in a dangerous post-pandemic world. Not gonna lie, kind of seems a little eerie considering all things. <laughs> A little too close to home with this one. But let's see. I'm just curious. I never. The next one is Uncharted 4. A Thief's End. Did you play any of these? I can't remember. Oh. So let's see what they put back here. Thrown back into the dangerous underworld he tried to leave behind, Nathan Drake must decide what he's willing to sacrifice to save the ones he loves. Join Drake on an epic adventure around the globe through jungle aisles, bustling cities, and snow-capped peaks in search of a lost fortune. This one's so good. I actually kind of want to play this. <laughs> okay, so this one. I actually just played this one, but I still brought it out. I've played it probably a couple times, but until dawn, I played it during winter time. I just like how you can choose all the different outcomes by selecting different options, choice options. So, um, yeah, I played it a couple times just to see what type of outcomes the game would give me. And I just literally played it this winter for like the third or fourth time. So, let's see. Only your choices determine who survives. <laughs> That's why I liked playing this one. You can play it so many times and get so many different outcomes. So, let's see what they say on the back. When eight friends return to the isolated mountain lodge where two of their group disappeared exactly one year ago. Things quickly turned sinister. Will you run from what's hunting you? Will you try to hide? Or will you stand and fight? You'll have to make split-second decisions. That will mean life or death for each member of the group. <laughs> And then it says, play as each of the eight friends, all of whom can live or die based on your decisions. See the impact of your choices in the path you've taken with the butterfly effect system. You've played this, right? So good. They did a really great job with that one, personally. So then... I had to bring this one out because I think that it's interesting due to some circumstances in the world. But yeah, I don't mind. We can break it open and play, even though we both played at your house last time. 
Let's see what it says on the back. For centuries, France has been ruled by the privileged few. No longer on this day, the people of Paris have risen up against tyranny. Now, in the midst of one of history's most chaotic and brutal revolutions, the fate of a nation rests on the edge of the assassin's blade. I like the movie too, Assassin's Creed, so good. So this one's fun, and I think it's kind of fitting for some reasons. Now, the next couple ones are fun. Because they're on the Wii. Princess Peach, and you can be Mario or Luigi. Would you be my Mario or would you be my Luigi? I thought so. So we can play Mario Kart or Super Mario, the 3D version. Super Mario 3D World, Mario Kart, or I'll be your Princess Peach, um, Assassin's Creed Unity, Until Dawn, Uncharted 4, The Last of Us Remastered. Or Assassin's Creed Black Flag. So, so I have for today one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven to choose from. So, I'm gonna put those right there next to you. You can go through them, yeah. Oh, that's a nice one. I like that one. Good idea. And then, do you want to use the black remote? Okay. Let me just clean off even over here too. I used my my brush, but now I think I'm just gonna use this pad. Make sure it's all clean and ready for you. So there you go. And then I thought, before we play, I could give you a little good luck charm. <laughs> and do a little ASMR to relax us before we have a long day of gaming. I'm just gonna go and lightly glide this right here to the side, to the side. Do you like the way it feels?
just glide inside the side just like that the side the side what's your favorite game to play or your favorite game of all time. Hmm. I don't know, I think I've played it. I think so. Side to side. When did you start gaming? And who introduced you to gaming? I can't remember if you've told me. Mm. Yeah, I think it was just friends. Oh, a console? Um, I first started First console was PlayStation. Yeah. PlayStation was the first console I played on. What's the longest that you've played straight? Well, uh, are you currently playing any games like outside of, of us hanging out though? Like any stories, story games? Or, mm, fun. I think that this is going to bring you a lot of good luck to the game we're about to play. A lot of good luck to you. Thirty. Twenty nine. Twenty
Thank you so much for watching this all the way to the very end. I really appreciate it. But before you leave, I'd like to give a special shout out to my pixie pals. They are Armando, Tim, Tyke, Aloy, John, Nate, Rob, Victor, Wyatt, Dylan, Derek J, David B, Ninja, David, JK135, Brand Angel, Kieran, Ben, the Nameless Usurper, and Mike, 4657 Gaming. Thank you so much for your continued support of my channel. It truly means so much to me. If you're interested in becoming a Pixie Pal, some of the fun perks include early access to videos, exclusive members only content, member shoutouts, a chance to be named a character in an upcoming video, and more. Click the join button down below or the link in my description for more information. Also, if you liked this video and my type of content, go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. Turn your bell notifications on, give me a thumbs up, and even leave me a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Well, I hope to see you on the inside as a pixie pal, and in my next video.